Okay, hey guys, welcome to Ham Radio with K0PIR. I've got my uh, Mini 60 here. I'm going to show you how it works and I'll show you this 9 to 1 unbalanced to unbalanced. But first, I'm running a uh, 58 foot random wire in my backyard and it goes to a 20 foot fishing pole, a wonder pole. 58 foot random wire runs back to that shed back there. And I hope you can see that okay. Uh, I've been using this with my KX2 with this uh, binding post, and you know it worked okay. I've made some contacts with it, but you know I I really needed a, a nine to one unbalanced to unbalanced uh, to help the tuner out. And what I can do with this is bring down the impedance of that random wire and uh boy let me show you what it looks like right now i'm going to turn on the mini 60 this is the new one it's bluetooth there's an app that goes with the phone right now you can see the impedance uh impedance uh 310 310 ohm 315 ohm swr is really high it takes a lot for the tuner to tune that so let me hook up the 9 to 1 and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, I've got the 9 to 1 hooked up and it's just attached to the 58 foot random wire. I've got it connected to the binding post and I wouldn't use it this way normally. Let's turn it on, the Mini 60. And have a look at it and look it is a lot better now Let's take a look at another band and see what it looks like On uh, 17 meters SWR is still really high On uh, 15 meters Yeah, it gets a lot better. I need to adjust the length on it but Let me hook it up to the uh, let me hook it up to the KX2 and we'll uh, see what it looks like there. Okay, I've got it hooked up to the KX2, 40 meters. That wire won't tune up on 80, but it tunes up on 40 really good. And if I didn't have that unbalanced to unbalanced on there, uh, it would take quite a bit longer to tune up and it wouldn't be as good Let me uh, Let me go to 20 meters And look at that it's really good Fifteen meters One to one so that's it. I'm going to take this 9 to 1, I'm going to get rid of the binding post, and I'm going to solder a BNC onto this, and wrap it up in some heat, heat shrink, or some tape, and then on this, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I might just attach a 130 foot wire coiled up and then extend it when i get to where i'm going just extend it as far out as i can yeah it must be a contest
<laughs> Alright, well, we got it. Okay, well, I made a contact, and, uh, I'll have to look that up and see what it is. But anyway, it works. How you doing, little pal? This is my little buddy, Mr. B. Thanks for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. Also, tell your friends. 73 and good DX.